Kevin Hart is at it again, this time posing as the best man for a socially awkward groom played by Josh Gad in the new buddy comedy, The Wedding Ringer. You need seven, seven groomsmen? I do. You're asking me to pull off a golden tux? Yes, see, I don't see that on this pamphlet here. What you're talking about is what we joke about around here. That's a laugh. Hey, we should try to do a golden tux. <laughs> we caught up with both Hart and Gad during the film's press junket and had a little fun talking about their new film. Josh, how are you? I'm doing great. What was it like doing this movie? Because you were absolutely amazing. You were the only good actor Wait, in this movie. Wait a minute. You know what, I'll tell you what. Right when here. you have to carry the load, uh, Wait, come on. so to what speak, when you have about? to uh, put your co-star on your shoulders. Wait a second. And, um... You know, coming what? coming off of the failure of Ride Along. Wait a minute, I feel Ride like, did a lot of money. It was great. I feel like he needed uh he needed to pick me up. And I was there for my new friend. Kevin, I was really impressed with your dance skills. First of all, I'm an amazing dancer. And what you saw was the tip of the iceberg. Okay? Now if you put me in a real dancing environment, oh I'll cut a mean rug. Teach me how to doggy, teach me, teach me how to doggy. Teach me how to doggy, teach me, teach me how to doggy. All my women love me, all my all my women love me. All my women love me, you ain't messing with my doggy. But while the film is full of laughs and a colorful cast, including Jennifer Lewis, Atheon Crockett, and Kaylee Cuoco Sweeting, it's got a lot of heart. Pun intended. I think we balanced out all the crazy with the 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 emotional levels. You know, I think telling this story that people aren't even expecting to see. I think the title basically makes people feel like it's such a wedding-like movie, but it's completely opposite. You know, the wedding is the last thing that you're gonna focus on with the movie. It's the craziness and mayhem that's going on in the middle of it. But more importantly, the relationship that these two guys are building along the way, and and the roller coaster ride that we take you on where it eventually ends at, I think it's so relatable, so grounding, and, and it's something that people are going to go, you know, I get it. The Wedding Ringer hits theaters January 16th. For HipHollywood.com, I'm Jasmine Simpkins.